Ferdinand left behind is he tried by constitutional means to restore our political status as one of three uh, territories in Malaysia as per Malaysia agreement. Okay. And we will continue to make sure that our Sarawak government will fulfill this. This is a duty all to the people of Sarawak. At the same time, we uh, congratulate Chief Minister Abanjo and uh, we urge Chief Minister Abanjo Johari to do better than what the late Adinan had done. Regretfully, during Adina's tenure, he failed to protect NCR land rights of Pemakai Menua and Pulau Galau. This was because on 20th of December 2016, that just uh, more than a month ago, the federal court had declared that Pulau Galau and Pemakai Menua had no force of law. So in one stroke, the federal court had extinguish and deny our Sarawak natives our customary rights over Pemakai Menua and Pulau Galau. Our natives have been denied their rights, which they had to, the customary right to collect forest resources for generations and hundreds of years before there was even Malaysia. So this is uh, one of the rights that we are fighting for. This is a major part of our perjuangan, especially for this, uh, <coughs> about, uh, that, sorry, for this Tanjung Tato by election. And uh, on a lighter note, contrary to popular opinion, the election process is not always of taxpayers' money, but it will benefit the local economy and bring development benefits and attention to the people of Tanjung Tato after decades of neglect. Okay. And uh, lastly, we conclude, Ta will not deny Slovakians the right to the democratic process of political elections. We want to hear now and how and what are the promises the Slovak government and PM Najib will deliver during the election. <laughs>